In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get really sweet vocals in your tracks through the use of vocal chopping in Recycle. To start with, open Recycle and open the acapella waveform that you have chosen. My one's called Justin Bieber Acapella. It's not actually Justin Bieber though. And simply increase the sensitivity. Here you can see the sensitivity slices being able to pick out the kind of sections of the waveform that are most prominent and the loudest. Obviously the more sensitivity you increase, the more slices you're going to get. You can move the slices around, they don't have to be where they're automatically set. So you can kind of pick out areas of the acapella that you really want to uh, play with. You can zoom in with at the bottom left so you can make everything really tight and not clip. Because usually at the start and end of uh, kind of areas you cut, you're going to get like a little click. But I'll show you how to get rid of those if you have any later. Now you can just change around the slices and kind of get the sections of vocals that you really want. So once you've had a play with that and you've got the samples and slices of where you want them, the kind of style I've gone for a nice quick kind of choppy oohs and ahs, which sound really good when laid with drums. One note to make now is that the Dr. X player on Reason can only take 92 slices. And on the recycle window at the bottom right, it says how many slices there are. So far, I've got 82, so I've got another 10 I can play with. Once you've got it all set out and laid out how you want, just save it as, and it will save it as a Rex file for you to load straight into Reason. So as you can see, I've already loaded it into Reason, and I've written down some notes that I want to play with. So to begin with, just create a Dr. Octo Rex in the first kind of loop slot available, open browser and just load in the Rex file. It usually has your recent items there as well. And then that will load all of these slices up onto the side here when you go into the piano roll. The visual representation of the waveform that you did in Recycle is displayed here. And every little red line is the slices that you place down. You can select each slice by using the slice knob here. You can just scroll through them. You can edit the pitch and pan each separate slice to how you want. Just like so. So let's just listen to some of the notes that I've got. See, it's fairly basic, just a nice little vocal line. Some of the effects that I've applied to this is uh, the RV7000 reverb. Let me just unbypass it so you can hear it. Just I increase the dry and wet and leave a little bit of decay on just to give a bit of presence and ambience to the vocals. This is already sounding much better. Another little effect that I've added is the DDL digital delay line. I've just set that as 320 milliseconds just because it's in time with the BPM which is 140 at the moment but obviously you can just play around with the millisecond settings and just to get all the vocals in time so it's a fairly subtle delay but it really does make a nice big difference to the vocals last but not least just apply a maximizer just to boost the signal input gain 4 millisecond look ahead a little bit of output gain and soft clip Let's listen to it with all the rest of the mix. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching and remember to check out the website for more tutorials.